It's a homecoming night that some London ISD students didn't expect to spend fighting for their lives. Department of Public Safety officials saying just before 8 o'clock Friday evening, two ATVs crashed head on near Chapman Ranch and County Road 57. Two victims were taken to the hospital by ambulance or family members. One was halo flighted. Another was treated on the scene with minor injuries. Taylor Alanis talked, uh, has been talking all day, that is, with friends and family of these victims. She's in the studio right now. Taylor, what do we know so far? Pat, London ISD confirms two of the victims are current students. Family friends telling us off camera at least one other is a former student. Now, one of those students, a 16-year-old girl, is at Driscoll Children's Hospital in good condition. DPS say DPS officials say the other victims ages were 17, 20 and 20. Two victims remain at Chris's spawn shoreline. DPS officials say they've undergone undergone multiple surgeries and are in critical condition. Public information officer for DPS Sergeant Guadalupe Casares says no protective gear was worn and two of the occupants were not wearing their seat belts. Casares wants to remind the Republic that ATVs are not allowed on public roadways and anyone who operates or is a passenger in an ATV must wear goggles, gloves, a helmet, long sleeve shirt, pants and boots. It is unknown if any charges will be filed, but DPS is still investigating that crash. Last night, the community gathered to host a prayer vigil for both victims are the victims at both of those hospitals. London ISD says they had counselors available today for students and teachers who needed them. Pat.